Hi, this is Sai Morton with the daily update on EuroFX. I post my exclusive market overviews with the key political and economical events, charts and important levels on the ForexPsyme.com forums weekly. This short video is a response to rapidly changing situation on the currency markets and should help you to stand top of the game and be profitable. I suggest you to visit ForexPsyme.com forum and read my analysis for the week before watching this daily video. Welcome everybody guys, let's take a look at the New York currency again. So here we consider on a daily chart the potential bread and butter trade. Well actually we do not exclude the chance that it could be not uh, strictly uh, matched to Judd Napoli conditions because you can see that market stands very close to the area where potentially it could start. But we do not have yet the close below the 3 by 3 At the same time the retracement mostly to the 3 8 support and conference support mostly is done and market is preparing for reaction so we know that it's probably should be 618 retracement up uh, from the support area that is the idea of the brand by the trade at the same time on the intraday charts there are a few scenarios how the situation could develop and uh, as you will see it, it it would be better to split your positions in few parts and if you would like to take the long position on this trade and uh, use them depending on the price behavior so for example First of all, on the on the four-hour time frame chart, take a look at our uh, recent picture that we discussed yesterday. As soon as market closed the gap, show mine and pull back right to the 3.8 resistance and starts dropping again. So currently, it returns right back down in the gap gap area, which suggests that it could really reach the support area, the predefined confidence support on the daily chart. So this 12.21, 12.48 is the level that market could hit. Uh, chance exists for that. On the hourly chart, which is our major picture currently, there's a few scenarios that market could follow. First of all, take a look that on the way down, market has completed this A, B, C top OP target. As you see, reaction is 12.53. But market hasn't tested the confidence support. Uh, and here's two possible scenarios uh, we have. First is the kind of a hand and shoulders patch and if market will start up reaction right from here showing the 618 retracement a bit in advance of the reaching of the 1222 area which is the major 30% support on the daily chart where theoretically in a normal market normal conditions the bread and butter should start. That's the first scenario that could happen so uh, the first level actually where you theoretically could consider taking the position was the OP so ABCD completion uh, and currently that's potential these lows because here theoretically market could start up protection. Here's some part of your position could be taken. Uh, but major level to keep an eye on is of course 1222, 1227. Uh, this is the point that could be reached if market will start to form the that is uh, free drive buy pattern. Usually got a free, uh, free drive buy consists of the two side-by-side -side butterflies and you can see here we have the first butterflies 127 extension actually it, it is uh, finalized the OP target so market completed butterfly hits the OP shows retracement the 618 1618 extension stands right here but at the same time the 127 of this retracement stands at the same area so as you can see the two extensions coincide in one point that's typical and classical shape for the three drive pattern and that's why our second scenario here is to get another butterfly which could be uh, should reach this level 1222 1227 that level coincides with the daily 30 percent support and confidence support and from the theoretical point of view that's that perfect combination for starting on the bread and butter trade so uh, here you could choose uh, uh, could choose your, your preferable approach to this trade if you would like to, you could split your position in, in a few parts. So, for example, taking a small part here, market will complete this level, take another part here. But the major condition is to place stop below the confidence area on the daily chart. Uh, another opportunity is just to follow the major pattern. For example, you do not want to take position here uh, and you are prefer to uh, follow the perfect scenario so you, you just could sit on the hands and see if market will form the free drive pattern well that's great you could take the position right here it will be strong support area suggest the pullback 
So anyway, uh, retracement should be this 1618, uh, 618 uh, to the 618 resistance of the whole downward direction, depending on where it will stand. Here is also we have the accompanied by emergence, uh, divergence by the MACD. So that's actually the scenario that we will keep an eye on today. Uh, let's see uh, what the euro will show us.